All right, so the first thing you do is you turn on the Dyna Summit up there. It's just a little switch. Right now it is already on. After that, you want to turn on the dynos. There's a little switch behind it that you can just feel. These things take about a minute to start up. Now that these start up, you want to connect to the... Alright, so you reconnect to the Dyno Summit. And see we have no session, so you want to click New Session, and then you name it. Now you want to make sure Loop Record is on. It's really important, because it means if we run out of data, it'll start deleting the old data, instead of just turning off completely, which is very important during a game. So this is Dino A. Dino A you want to keep camera 1 and 3 on, or channels 1 and 3 I should say. Channel 1 holds the recorders, channel 3 holds the player. Dino B is the exact opposite, you keep 2 and 4 on and 1 and 3 off. And after that you start it up, and that's it. Well, I guess I'll talk about the live. So right now it is not recording, this is grayed out. You push this button right here. And then that turns it, once it's red, that means it's recording. It allows you to rewind any part of the game. In order to stop that, you click shift, then record stop. And then you know it stopped because it'll be grayed out. Nope, that's it. 